Hi everyone, I'm Sam Tucker from Apple, and I've just snuck on stage here at CES to have a little look at this device that's been taking the world by storm. Introducing the all new Rabbit R1. Phone. Thing. So apparently the R1 works with one of the most advanced AIs on the planet in order to perform the breathtaking task of clicking around apps for you. That's right. Instead of using the touchscreen as a touchscreen, like most phones, to interact with the R1, you have to talk to this little rabbit and just hope that it knows what you want, even if your accent is a little bit hard to understand. Play Craftworks Parking Calculator. Well, good luck with that one. So this breakthrough AI is called LAM, which is what most of the users will look like after using the thing. Because why exercise your fingers or brain navigating some of the most simple and easy to use apps on the planet when you can just press the button on the side of this children's toy and ask it for anything you want, such as to play music, book an Uber or order a cheese pizza. And I'm sure soon you won't even have to make full sentences. You could just press the button and say, Aah! and the device will order fresh ice cream directly to your door. Now, unfortunately, for the time being, you will still have to get off your fat ass to answer the door. But I'm sure they're working on an aeroplane that'll fly food directly into your face. The R1 also has a camera on the side that can identify objects in the real world in case your eyes are too lazy to do that for you. Oh, oh, there they go, they've gone asleep. In fact, I pointed it at the fridge once to figure out what these weird things are in there. I mean, they kind of look like the things the Uber Eats man gives me, but cold and healthy. I didn't like it. I can also point it at this thing to find out what's a computer. And with the 4G cellular connection, it can even work outside. In fact, here's one of their team from Pallet Town to show you how that works. What is that? Steelix, the Iron Snake Pokemon. Wow, you know, all of this sounds very complex. And you're probably wondering, how long does this small device take to complete a single task? Well, let's have a look just how long it does take with a real time example during the actual rabbit presentation. Starting now. Sure, I'm working on it. Okay, just thinking about it. <laughs> Please take a look ah, at it. Ah, too slow, let me know you stupid you thing. That's it, I'm gonna email them a complaint. Not good enough, rabbit. Took almost 10 seconds. I almost had to use my own fingers. Ah, stuff it. You know what? It's not really worth it. Because for this device, their team is only charging $199. Oh, wow. That's as much as we charge for an iPad case. On sale, the all new Rabbit R1. Imagine if your iPhone only ran Siri. Good Lord. Subscribe today. Hey everyone, thanks for watching the video. And you know, with your fingers free now, like mine are, why not use them to subscribe? And check out another fun tech parody, written by a human. Tell you what, took me a little longer than 10 seconds, so <laughs> check him out.